This is a brand new vehicle. It runs great, and we want to make sure that it keeps running great. And there were issues with this particular engine right there, but we got with the guys from Baxter Performance because they got a fix for this. You know, with these Pentastar engines, it's an oiling issue is what they have. There's no anti-drain vac or, or no check valve in the oiling system. So what happens is after you shut the engine off, it only takes 35 to 38 minutes for the engine oil to drain all the way back to the pan. So when you go to restart it, you're a dry starting, and that's the most right. problematic thing you have for an engine is because you have no lubrication as this thing is spinning over. Here's the replacement from Baxter Performance. So basically, your stock oil filter would come out, which is nice and easy, top and center, and this is going to slide down in there, right? Once you get in there, so that takes up that space, this is your adapter, and then your oil filter will screw on right here. Now, the magic happens right here. See, you've got this little check valve, and that's mounted in here this way. Now, take a look at that. So you can see that. Boom. See that? It's spring-loaded. So pretty much now, when you shut the vehicle off, that's going to go whoop and close that, and all the oil is not going to drain back down there into the pan. And that's how it all happens. So here is the, the factory oil filter. You can see it is bone dry because it's all drained back into the engine. So where this sits is just like this with our new adapter. You can see the little O-ring on the bottom here is going to seal up just like it did in the factory. But what we have to do is we'll tighten this down and back it off enough to get it clocked where we need to. And the reason we can do that and still stay sealed is because this is spring-loaded, this docking collar. So when we get it where we want it, it'll always stay pressurized and keep everything sealed off. Now, when we get it where we want it, there's a little Allen head right here, which allows us to tighten down, and this little docking cleat locks into place, so this won't unscrew when you try and get a filter out of the way. So this simply goes down here, and what we'll do once we get it in place, we're gonna tighten it down, find our spot to lock it in, and then we're gonna put on this little 90 degree fitting, and then you've got a Schrader valve that goes into it. Now the purpose for this is once you've got this thing running, obviously oil will stay inside that filter. When you want to change the oil, you simply quickly pressurize this. It opens that check valve, allows the oil to drain down. So when you change your oil filter, no mess. These guys have thought of everything.